Hello, I'm Rainer from Toshiba. We are here in the Toshiba HDD application lab and today I want to discuss again the question HDD versus SSD. So these are SSDs. They are small, they are light, they are fast, but they are rather expensive in terms of cost per capacity. This is a hard disk drive. Its technology is based on spinning disk and magnetic recording. It's rather slow compared to SSDs, but it has just a fraction of the cost per capacity. So it's rather cheap. So the question is, when to use what? And the features of both storage components, as they are doing more or less the same, but with different performance and with different price determines when to use what. So in any mobile component, for any type of boot device, SSD is the better option. Whether it's in a laptop or a small or larger PC, where the storage requirements in terms of capacity are not so high, uh, you use SSD as a boot. Also, for booting an enterprise server like that one, we are using SSDs, but only for the boot device. And in central enterprise servers, which serves databases or very um, high performance storage, we are using NVMe SSDs. But the limit of all these applications is the capacity. When we go for higher capacities uh, with less performance requirements, we use HDDs. For example, in RAID boxes like this network attached storage or a direct attached storage, we can use hard disk drives of 4 to 20 and even more terabyte so that we have dozens of terabytes for a rather low cost. Also in enterprise storage servers, like that one, we have the boot SSD, but we have 12, 20 terabyte hard disk drives. Yeah, that gives us a quarter of a petabyte for a reasonable cost. And as we have 12 of these slow devices, the 12 combine their speed together and still have a reasonable performance. And finally, for the large cloud petabyte scale storages in high density top loaders, of course, we use hard disk drives, giving us one to two petabyte of storage. That would be impossible to do with SSDs. So in that application, we will have many HDDs and with 60 to 100, their performance combined, also supporting the speed requirements of cloud applications. So the answer to when to use HDD, when to use SSD is simple. If it is about speed with less capacity requirements, for any type of boot or core storage applications with uh, uh, performance requirements, we use SSDs. If it is about capacity for a reasonable cost, we use HDDs. And as the cost gap between HDD and SSD will stay more or less the same because both are further developed, that will also remain as an answer for many, many more years to come. So, thank you for listening and for any questions, please feel free to ask us. We will help you in your decisions with proof of concepts and other activities.